Thanks, Jenna. Bartley Kivas from the Winnipeg Free Press joining us now to talk about a couple of issues. Uh, we're going to get to the bug poop in a minute that's covering your cars and the streets, but first we want to talk about audits. Yeah, fascinating news. This is it's happened on Friday, but it's still really important because a lot of people are trying to figure out exactly what it means still right now. The uh, province of Manitoba, Manitoba Justice, has forwarded three city audits to the RCMP to look at for a potential of a criminal investigation. And even more fascinatingly, they've also sent over related materials. Now, I don't know what those related materials are. I'm going to dial it back a minute to remind people those three audits. There was the Fire Paramedic Station Construction mm -hmm. Review that originally came out back in October. There was the Winnipeg real estate audit that came out at the beginning of July of this year, and then the uh, audit or the review of the Winnipeg Police Headquarters construction, and uh, also the contracting of that. So that information, City Council passed that over to Manitoba Justice. Manitoba Justice has passed that over to the RCMP, and you know, the wheels are turning, and it's interesting. Now, it does not mean that they're going to actually investigate in late charges. Charges are something that, that's all up to the RCMP. Uh, and people are asking, well, what kind of, what even kind of investigation would they be looking right. at? Who knows? Um, there are different offenses uh, that they could be looking at, but it's, it's not very clear what will happen next or whether anything will happen next. And all this is happening, of course, in the background of a civic election. Okay, so interesting timing with all that, of Interesting course. timing, but the fact that they actually went through with it in the middle of the civic election meant that Manitoba Justice felt there must have been something there for at least, that would at least warrant the review of the RCMP. Okay, switching gears a little bit, let's talk about this aphid excrement. Aphid excrement, yes, it's officially called honeydew. Okay. Aphids are these little tiny green things, you might see them on some of your plants. They uh, wreck you your garden. You might not see them up on your trees, uh, but what they do is they, uh, they eat the sap, and, and sap has tree tree sugars in it, they don't consume all the sugars and they actually excrete a substance called honeydew which takes the form of this sort of crystalline sticky stuff that uh, cyclists say, hey, it's great traction around corners and <laughs> when you go and you touch your car, if your car is parked under a tree, uh, especially before that big rain on Sunday night, it was really, really sticky and um, a lot of people, if you, if you happen to actually touch that to your mouth, yeah, it will taste like fructose. Ooh, but, don't well, do that. But it's basically inert sugars. It's, it's, not, it's not posing any human health risk. Aphids can, by through their saliva, not their excrement, uh, hurt plants and crops in particular uh, because they can pass on viruses. But it's just right. fascinating in the city. Yeah, we have mosquito trap counts. We have uh, caterpillars and canker worms that we need to control. And we also have uh, a coverage in the late summer of aphid excrement. Always something. I know you talked to some experts too about it. Uh, don't the mosquitoes like this stuff? Yeah, here's the fascinating thing. Mosquitoes actually feed on aphid excrement along with nectar from plants. They need that energy to fly. Now, female mosquitoes, yeah, they, they consume blood, but they consume blood as a meal for their eggs, their young. Um, they don't, or, or to produce eggs rather, excuse me, but they actually, to get the energy to fly around, they need, they need the excrement. So male mosquitoes, uh, all they do is eat honeydew and, and nectar. So yeah, mosquitoes are among the insects that actually consume uh, aphid excrement because it's, hey, it's free sugar, it's all lying around. It's like that episode of Homer Simpson, of The Simpsons, where Homer Simpson says, free goo, and he puts it in his mouth, you know? Ugh. It's like, it's just out there. Gross. Very quickly, anything we can do? Uh, not really, it's, there's Wait no... Wait it out? Wash your car. Wash your car, wash your fluid, and don't lick it. In other right? cities where there's even, well, yeah, don't, I mean, if you really, uh, <laughs> you, that is just, hey, and now for breakfast, it's not just for breakfast anymore. You and the mosquitoes can share it. Thank you so much, Bartley. More BT coming up. Your entertainment headlines. Stick with us.